Hello and welcome to the 40th MLK Community Leaders Breakfast hosted by your Virginia Union University. We're excited that all of you have joined us again to celebrate the legacy and memory of the vision of the Reverend Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. as articulated clearly in 1963 at the Lincoln Memorial. Today is a day that we remember championing causes of social justice and civil rights for all people. The purpose of the breakfast was first of all to uh, what, celebrate and affirm the fact that Virginia Union uh, was about the business of producing leaders. And so we felt that if we have a leader's breakfast, uh, it should be hosted and anchored at Virginia Union. Virginia Union is such a beautiful example of sort of rising from the ashes, uh, you know, in the in the most horrible place uh, from African Americans uh, before the Civil War. Uh, the Devil's Half Acre uh, came uh, an institution that would educate uh, first free blacks, and and uh, and for a long time was the only real opportunity for higher education for for blacks in the Richmond region and beyond. Dominion Energy is proud to have been the lead sponsor of the VUU Community Leaders Breakfast for 40 years. The first breakfast occurred during the mayoral term of Henry Marsh, a 1956 Union graduate who was Richmond's first black mayor. Here we are 40 years after the first Community Leaders Breakfast, which each year is dedicated to the legacy of Reverend Dr. Martin Luther King Jr and those who have lived to the ideals of that legacy, like Senator Marsh. Although Dr. King never saw his 40th birthday, today, 50 years after his death, his legacy lives and abides through those of us who are here this morning, and it will guide us for all eternity. When we brought Coretta uh, Scott King here, uh, the power company was gracious uh, to be host and to uh, provide a setting that she would converse and to talk about her, her husband and also uh, the movement. Another memorable moment uh, uh, had to do when the company began to kind of spread its wings, so to speak, and make investment. Uh, it was at the breakfast uh, that they announced their 800 a thousand dollar investment for leadership and Virginia Union uh, was the recipient of that and that was done uh, in the midst uh, of the breakfast. And the Martin Luther King Bill was signed here on the campus in Henderson Center. Senator Waller at that time uh, uh, as well as myself helped to organize that. As we celebrate the contribution of Dr. King and all of the civil rights leaders from throughout the Commonwealth, particularly in the city of Richmond, I want to thank Dr. Pleasance and Reverend Milner for stewarding this idea. You will never be forgotten. To all of the leaders who are present, to all of those who are members of the community who are coming to share with us, Virginia Union University continues to be a place where we remember the power of social justice to transform lives. Thank you and welcome again.